Hello you beautiful people and welcome back to Let's Play Ellen Wake 2. Wait, I'm not gonna apply that now. You're gonna save that a little bit. Yeah, the current theme, right? Since a couple of episodes. Low on everything. That is how we currently roll. Um, yeah, I'm not that... I'm not feeling that good about that. On the other hand... That is currently not changeable. And I do hope that that was the engagement. Otherwise, a... Okay. Can't get up there. Then, if dudes come up, if enemies come up, we roll by, you know, just retreating. Not the Spartan way, but the only way we have. Well... Okay, good. At least a little bit of ammunition. Not saying no. Alright, that is where we came. No, we came from there. Are we able to traverse here? I would say no pity dope. Yep, that is... The general... Store... Uh, pop, 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 pop. I'm stuck, I'm stuck, I'm stuck, that's great. great. Run. Just run. If you truly want to beat it, just run. Not even sure if the general store is the right location. We ain't have a map available. That's the bad part. Then, first things first, let's actually take a quick look. Um, I guess past Psychic, if the state of this building has not changed, already has looted everything. But that minute we have. Okay, then this was a total moot point, forgive me. Yeah, we've been in the restroom, in the toilet, room, in the bathroom, maybe that's the better way. There, okay, we can go on here too. Yeah, that exit is not gonna be an exit, we don't even, we just need to find the car, right? I am just gonna take the wild guess that in the general store there is not anything to loot. Oh boy, he can open the door, who would have guessed? Alright. In the dark place, the dark presence went into me. When I was pulled back here, crossing over and weakened it, made it dormant. I couldn't remember what had happened, but I could feel it, getting stronger, waking up. I thought it was haunting me, closing in. It was inside me the whole time, and then it took over, turned me to scratch. Anything? No. Okay. Okay, good. 
so I'm then just am presuming that in a general store there wouldn't be anything to t pick up. That's now gonna be how I roll. Um, game. I was afraid I would be stuck. What the hell is ah? That's just the okay. The balls. See this through to the end. Yes, we will. I brought Saga Anderson into this story to help me escape. She succeeded. It cost her everything. I'd used Alex Casey in my writing for years. The real Casey had been drawn here because of that. Now he was a victim too. Saga, Casey, Alice, all this horror originates from me. It's my fault. Scratch had to be stopped. I've driven down this road before. Been driving on it forever. brought the dark place here this would take me back inside in 2010 I had dived in a leap of faith for Alice with no idea that the cost would be a nightmare worse than death it had taken me 13 years to get out now Alice was dead because of me I was going to make that leap again, this time knowing the cost all too well. Another way to look at it? I had brought the dark place here with me. I never had gotten out. Maybe after this I finally could. It was a fool's hope. I had no choice. I had to do it. That didn't make me any less terrified. Fuck it. Dear Fest, Return 8. This is not what I expected. And for a change, which is actually not that bad, we is it is home. bright. Return has readers on the edge of their seats. A spell binding short of force. Okay, we need just need to explore. Fair enough. Dancing time, just fine. Oh, hello, dudes. Yep, they played a good concert. I needed to get a copy of Return. I needed to read the ending to have a shot at changing it. I okay, was get a copy. Scratch's ending, a perverse version of reality. The townspeople brainwashed. Everyone and everything revolved around return, as if it had just been published. Now, is there a bookshop? Do we have the mind plan? No, we don't have to. Writer's room. I oh, forgive me. Available. There we go. 
I could see the round windows of the writer's room in the photo. That's where I had to go. To rewrite the ending of Return. It's a sick, sick story! <laughs> Mm-hmm. Okay. I did not expect that we would die that quickly. All right, run. Um, we do not have guns. And just be quick. We can skip that. Left is bad, right is bad, so I'm gonna go straight right. Oh, I try. And avoid enemies. I did try. I did try to dodge. I tried to use the dodge button. I do not know if I either pressed it with the wrong timing. Possible. Quite possible. Or maybe if it's just not available. Don't quit. They grab us! But the direction is right. I'm sorry. It just takes you a little bit. Fair enough. Come on, load up game, load up. Skip the cutscene and run, baby. Room to stop this horror story. But where and how to get there without weaponry is a big question, right? This was an obsessive, egocentric nightmare, all revolving around a vain monster of a writer and his final divine work of art. The novel returned come true. It wouldn't stop here, it would keep spreading. Oh, wait a second. Is this the... I needed to reach the writer's room. Write a new conclusion. Was Scratch's insecure need for fame, for praise, drawn from my psyche? I would bring his sick fantasy crashing down around him. Didn't realize that is the nursing room, right? I had to find another way inside. Please not through the basement. Please not through the bunker or the basement, whatever that was, where we got, got through a saga. And please not through this. But I think that is gonna be... The way, oh boy. Yep, close to. Then the only way is through there. I honestly did not expect... Alice? Alice? What was that? Alice was dead. Was this a trap? Or was Scratch torturing me? Maybe both? And yes, I do not know if we need ammunition. I'm just looking for it. Yeah. That noise was not good, right? Alice. We are currently then... Ah, that's Alice. At the point... Which... Frightens and excites me, because we do not have any sort of ammunition. So the only thing is we can do is run. The game saved. So I do assume we are going to run into enemies in the next episode, you guys. For now, you know it. I, as usual, really, really thank you for watching. If you guys actually do have enjoyed today's episode, then please give me a little tinsy thumbs up and subscribe. And hopefully, and hopefully I see you in the next episode. Until then, I wish you all a wonderful day. Stay frosty. Bye.